Human society is built around the spaces that we share. The internet was supposed to bring us all together, but many of the shared spaces online are becoming toxic, being drowned out by trolls and by attacks and abuse. I don't see how we can ever move forward together as a society if there's nowhere we can talk about our issues. We can be better than this. We have to be. I have experienced hateful comments, um, comments that were discriminatory. And how that sort of fuels me to do my job is that I want people not to experience those things. It, it shuts down conversation. It ends conversation. The trolls are winning to the extent that they have driven some news organizations to shutter their comment sections. Places like the New York Times comment sections shows that you can have a civic discourse. Doing it right is hard and it takes resources, but we're about holding that town square open for people and hoping they come in and take part. Comments are a space where anyone can contribute. They represent the dream of the internet. They're the thing that we hoped would allow us to really share our ideas and make progress. And they're also, in a way, the biggest tragedy of the internet. When we looked at the comment section of the New York Times, it really just stood out among newspapers for just how incredibly thoughtful and insightful and diverse the opinions were. Why is it so good was one of the questions we're asking. And it turned out that they were cracking it by just reading every single comment. There came a point when we were getting so many comments that we couldn't moderate them with the same kind of quality and the same kind of joy. They had a limited number of people on the team and could only open comments on 10% of the articles. And that was just a human bottleneck. Perspective is built using TensorFlow. TensorFlow lets us build artificial intelligence algorithms that find the patterns in data. Patterns like, is a comment toxic? Or will the New York Times moderators accept it or reject it? For me, working with AI, you know, I feel like I'm, I'm living in, you know, <laughs> Star Trek times where my coworker is a robot and we get along great. Now, every single top story on the homepage has comments on. That's just huge. And in terms of our business, the best thing that we can do to attract new subscribers is to make them feel connected to us and to one another. The Perspective Project allows us to scale that in ways that we couldn't imagine before. They give us the ability to com communicate with, with the world. You know, if you have a place where you can speak of these things that are going on, but without the attacks and the abuse that is way too present in our society right now, that's how we're gonna get out of it. That's how we're gonna get out of it.